Hello and welcome to Muskrat Corner. Today I'm going to show you how to use stamp mask. Uh, and by using a stamp mask you can create this three-dimensional image of your rub stamps as you can see here on this card I've made. Um, this is a stamped image and these ones they look like they are behind this one and that one look, looks like it's behind that one and this is created with a stamp mask and um, let me show you how what you need rubber stamp ink pad uh, a post-it note um, just a regular regular post-it note and some paper so go ahead and ink up that stamp like so There we are. Stamp your image. And then, with the ink that's left on your rubber stamp, go ahead and stamp on the post note and make sure that you stamp on this part here, the sticky part. There we are. And what you do now is that you cut out this image uh, from the post-it note and I have one here that I've prepared and you take your stamp mask and you place it over the image you just stamped on your paper like so and then go ahead and take your rub stamp again and ink it up and stamp right over that mask like so and one more time and stamp again now as you can see here's the mask and here are the two images I just stamped and what you do now you simply peel off the mask and there you go a three-dimensional image of your rubber stamp. So, wasn't that really, really simple? And, of course, you can do this with any rubber stamp that you have at home. And also, um, you can use these masks over and over again. So, um, uh, this is here. Uh, um, a fun way to 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 um, get some variation from your your rubber stamps. So I hope you try this because it's really simple and it's really fun. And I hope to see you next time. Thank you for watching.